I'm leaving for college tomorrow and I have pimple patches on my face that's what that is I kind of forgot to film and I'm currently packing my last bag and I'm struggling I'm gonna show you guys how it looks like so I have all this stuff and this bag is obviously not closing very well um, and it's definitely my fault because I kind of overpacked but I just need a lot of stuff you know I just woke up and today is the day I woke up so early. My flight isn't till 12, but my sister leaves from school at 6.40 and I had to say goodbye to her, so I'm gonna do that. So I'm at the airport and I'm waiting for my parents because I have TSA free check and they don't. So I went into a separate room as them. Um, and I just have all my stuff. I'm super excited. suit with like a mystery mask and I was like I think this guy is a professor um and then we get on the plane I didn't see like I wasn't near him so I didn't like say go blue or anything um and this is on our flight to Detroit just throwing that out there but then um we go on and there's a guy sitting in our row and it's him and my dad is like excuse me like I think you're like in the row in front, like we're in 26 and um, he gets up to move and he was like really nice about it and he like points, I was wearing my Michigan mask and he was wearing a mask and he points to my mask and I go, go blue and he goes, go blue um, and then I, he said something like I work there and I was like, oh, are you a teacher? And then I realized I was like, professor there, <laughs> so embarrassing. Um, but then like I talked to him, like he was a criminology teacher or professor. Ah. Um, and then I talked to him at the end of the flight and he was really nice and asking about like what I was majoring in. And then when I said that I was in Bursley, he was like, oh, awesome. <laughs> um, but he was really nice and it made me feel, I don't know, just like it, it felt nice to know that like teachers are humans too. Like he literally sat in the wrong spot. And I keep saying teachers, but I really need professors. So I need to get better about that but yeah I'm moving tomorrow so I'll take you guys along good morning you guys today is moving day and I'm wearing this shirt it looks black right now but it's definitely dark navy and it actually was my brother's and I just cropped it because <laughs> um, it didn't fit him any longer so um uh my move in time is 10 o'clock we're gonna get there a little early to see if they'll let us move in a little earlier because I feel like everyone that's time is at 10 o'clock is gonna be there at 10 o'clock. So it's 8.40 right now. I just blow dried my hair and um, packing everything up in the hotel to get ready to go. So I'm really excited. I'm also like really nervous. And my mom told me I shouldn't be nervous uh, because everyone else is in the same situation. But I still, I don't know why I just like, there's so much um, to do and to see and people to meet. So um, it's a big shift from what I have dealt with the last year where it's like, you can't be around people and all that. So um, yeah, I, I think the biggest thing is that it, it's just gonna be like a very dramatic change from what has <laughs> been my last year and a half. So I'll get back to you guys when we're moving in. So I'm in the car and back there, sorry mom, <laughs> is my mom and all of our stuff. So we're gonna be heading, well we're actually heading over but we're going to the gas station first 
and ironically right as we're leaving there was no one else in the parking lot but the car right next to us was also leaving so it not that it was that big of a deal because we were on the way out too but it just kind of was funny the dorm room looks like beforehand and then there's my parents you're fine <laughs> so we just came in and we loft in my bed we have we wanted to make sure that this fit so it's only on the like second one but I'm doing a half loft and this is what it looks like there's more space over here now that we've moved this over more Okay, so look, there's me in the mirror, but um, my parents are putting together my little cube unit. What is that even called? I'm just gonna call it a cube unit. And then I'm putting, hanging up my clothes and there's all this storage up here. And I've just been throwing bedding stuff on the bed because we're gonna do that last so that um, if our hands are like dirty or something or we throw something on it, it doesn't get the, everything all dirty. by getting a speaker because the speakers that we got didn't work um and then we're going out to eat and we showered because we <laughs> it was so hot um and firstly there's no ac or at least i don't know if the rest do but in where i was there was no ac so it was a really hot day so yeah thank you so much for watching the video i have been at michigan now for three weeks and i'm just uploading this now go blue um, and it's the best decision I ever made in my entire life. I literally like just love it. I mean, I'm literally constantly working on schoolwork or hanging out with people or just busy constantly, which is so nice, especially after a year of COVID where, or a year and a half of COVID where that wasn't the norm. I felt bored a lot. Um, and now it's go, 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 which I absolutely love. Um, I will be posting a room tour video soon. I still haven't hung stuff up on my wall, so I need to finish my room first. And then I also will be doing a day in the life video, so I'm super excited about that. So stay tuned for those. I love each and every one of you. Mwah.